teacher. Good night. Hello. Congratulations, teacher. Hey, thank you for Tuesday. Okay, thank you very much. Here, here we are to celebrate. <laughs> Okay. Yeah, yeah, we can we can set room. Okay. How's everything? Fine? Fine. I don't know what happened with with my video. Ah yes, you have a a background. Yeah. Yes, it has to do with the so, someone else used the computer, I think. Yes. Okay, good. Let's see. How was your weekend, people? Good? Did you have fun? Did you enjoy? Did you rest? Yes, that's, that's great. Okay. In my case. <laughs> you studied? No. No, okay. No. No practice. Oh, I started? yes, I studied English, yes. At ah, okay. University, no. <laughs> okay, good. That's okay, yes. That's fine. Arthur? I started and I made my my homework and I completed the the, the test the chapters. Oh, the chapters too. Okay, the and the, quizzes. and the quizzes too. Okay, good. By the way, have you received an email offering you classes? In my case, no. No. In my case, no. Okay, good. In my case, no. Yeah, because they were telling me that some students have been. I'm getting an email from uh, English Corporativo to to move to a different uh, program, but it's the same thing. Mm -hmm. uh, in case they they send you the email, they will give you more explanations, right? That was just for. Yes, I I wanted to make sure that you have the right information and no problem. But if you haven't, then let's wait to see what happens. Okay, good. Now let's see, we were last Thursday uh, talking about the future, right? Yes. Yes, let yes. me. Let's let me check because it has to be here. Okay, <clears throat> that's the one. Okay, this is the last one we, we were studying the surface, right? when we were talking about the going what he was going to do and what he was not going to do prediction but predictions based on the on the pictures and the things that we could see okay now we have this is the other part i wanted to to show you right then uh Is that interference in my computer or don't forget to to mute your microphones, your mics? I think it's in your computer because I, I should stop, right? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Yes, just make sure to keep uh, microphones off. In case you hear some noise coming from my computer, let me know too, okay? Because there might be an interference or something. Okay, good. Now this is a, a last uh, class I was telling you about the forms of going to and will. Now, if you see here, you will see also the, the simple present and you also see uh, the ING form, okay? Then, for example, it says here, hurry up, sir, you are going to be late. Okay, this is a prediction right because probably the the the, the shuttle has a special uh, specific time to leave mm -hmm. and the man is still outside the shuttle leaves in five minutes look at this the shuttle leaves 
simple present. Okay, to express future. Okay, don't worry. They won't leave. He is very sure, very certain without me. Why is he so certain? Because he's the pilot. Right? Okay. Okay, no problem in this moment. So we have prediction. Okay, and then we have the simple present because we're talking about a situation in which a, it's something that is already established. Okay, for example, a, when do we finish this course? Listen, I'm not saying when will we finish. I'm saying when do we finish in present. The question is in present. When do we finish this course? Um, who knows? But okay, we are going to finish the next Thursday. The, because if you, I have a question. If you are asking with do, we have to use the same auxiliary to respond to the question. Depends on the situation, right? What is the situation that we have? When do we finish? When do we finish this course? We are going to finish this Thursday. Okay, this Thursday, okay? That's a prediction because you already know. But according to, uh, let's say, the um, English Corporativo, right? They, they have, they have what? I don't know if on July 11th. No, they already have a schedule. Okay. Uh -huh. So they have established a specific date to finish this course. Okay, so that's why when you are asking about this specific question that you can say, okay, we finish on Thursday. When do we finish this course? We finish on Thursday, let me see, June 25th. We answer in present because okay. it's already set, okay? Uh, for example, when, when you go to the airport, you say, for example, I have, uh, I have to go to Mexico tomorrow, okay? My yeah. plane leaves, okay? My plane leaves, at what time? At 11. At 11. My plane leaves because it's a schedule already given. Okay. Tomorrow we, uh, we have another class. What time does this class start tomorrow? We are going to start the class at 8 p.m. Uh -huh. The class starts at 8 uh -huh. because uh -huh. I, I, already, I already established. Okay. Yeah, no. we, we, are, we are going to use going to and we are going to use the because we are part of the class tomorrow is part of the... Mm -hmm. Yes, you can use going to, right? You say, hey, we're going to start a class. Now, if I change that, okay, listen, tomorrow I have a little problem. I cannot teach at, at 8, okay? So the class uh, is going to be from 7.30 to 8.30. Okay, so in that case, I changed something that was already established. Okay, mm -hmm. but you will see other examples, but this is for you to, to have an idea now. If you have questions, let me know, okay? Anybody can interrupt and let me know if you have questions. Okay. Uh, Laura, can you please read this chart check here? and tell me okay. what is true or false. Okay. Mm, chart check, circle T, true or F, false. There are several ways to talk about the future. Okay, there are several ways to talk about the future. Is that true or false? True. 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 Yes, because yes, we see, true. Uh, we see going to and will. We see will. Uh huh. Yes. Now we see, for example, here. Look. Present continuous. Yes, present continuous. Mm -hmm. Okay, we see going to, will, 
going to present continuous and simple, simple present. present. Okay, mm -hmm. four different ways. Okay, to express ideas in the future. Okay, Anna, can you read the other one? Okay. Text, please. T or F, you can't use the present tense to talk about the future. Okay. True or false? This is true. It is true. You can't use the present tense to talk about the future? False. No, it's false. The present false. tense. Because you can use the present. Yes. Use the present, right? All right, good. Excellent. Okay, here you can see also the, okay, in affirmative form, we are going to leave for Mars soon. We will leave for Mars soon. We are leaving for Mars soon and we leave for Mars soon. Uh, we aren't going to leave until one. Then we have, if it is negative, we won't. Uh, the present continuous is similar to going to, we aren't. And if it is in present, we don't. Okay? We don't leave until one. For example, we don't finish this course, okay, until Thursday. So not today, not tomorrow, not the day after tomorrow, until Thursday. And then you have the questions, right? Uh, let's see, Mariela, can you please read the questions here? Okay, uh, yes or not question. Is she going to leave for Mars soon? Will she leave for Mars soon? Is she leaving for Mars soon? Does she leave for Mars soon? Okay, possible answers? Yes, yes she is. Yes, she will. Okay. Yes, she is, and yes, she does. Also, okay. when the short is affirmative, and when the answer is negative, is she isn't, mm -hmm. she won't, she isn't, and she doesn't. And she does. Okay, very good. Perfect. Good, good, good. Now, questions in this moment? Okay, yes, no question, right? Now, let's see, uh, Diego, can you please read the WH questions? Yes, WH, WH questions. When is she going to leave for Mars? When will she leave for Mars? When is she leaving for Mars? When does she leave for Mars? Okay, good. For example, uh, this could be a question like, when do you finish? When do you finish your English course? Okay, what time? It can be also what, what time? What time do you finish this class? Uh, we finish this class at nine. Yeah. Okay, oh, I finish this class at nine. All right, good. Now, but then we have something more specific about the use of the future. Okay, let's see. Nineve, can you please read the first grammar explanation up here? Use we going to will the present progressive and the simple and the simple present tense to talk about things in the future. Okay. Uh, read example, please. Example, I'm going to fly to Mars next week. I will fly to Mars next week. I am flying to Mars next week. I fly to Mars next week. Okay, good. Now, see the difference? Yeah. I'll fly, I'm flying. Yeah, in different tenses. Yes, depending on how uh, on how sure you are, there are some situations in which you can uh, you can use the four form, right? 
So I fly to Mars next week. If you say that, is the, and the people, for example, I'm going to fly to Mars next week. Okay, good. It's a plan that you have. I will fly to Mars next week. Okay, good. You know, I'm sure that he's going to travel. Then I'm flying is a plan, but it's more emphatic that I'm going to. Okay? And when they say I fly to Mars next week, it means no change, right? That's the plan. And next week I fly to Mars. Okay? I leave next week. And that's the way it is. All right? Good. Now, uh, can you please read the next one, which is Laura? Yes, no, Ricardo. Ricardo Ramirez, can you read here usage notes? Okay, number two. Usage notes. Sometimes only one form of the future is appropriate, but in, in many cases, more than one form is possible. A. You should be going to or will to make predictions or guesses. B. You should be going to, not will, when something in the present leads to prediction. C. You should be going to, will, or the present prophecy to talk about future intentions or plans. D. We often use will when when we decide something at the moment of speaking we also use will uh, will to make offers e we often use the present progressive when we talk about future plans that have already been arranged there is usually some reference to the future that shows that the event is not happening now and if f Use the simple present tense to talk about scheduled future events such as time, time, I don't know how to say this word, such as mantles, timetables. I can hear it, teacher. Teacher, I can I can hear you. Teacher, you are in mute. Yes, it's on mute. Thank you. Yeah, I knew. Was looking for the for the click. Okay, hi, schedule. And I don't know how to say the words <laughs> such as after such as what such as timetables. Timetables, programs, and schedules. Schedule. Schedule. Okay, good. Thank you. Then uh, there are some examples here. Um, probably uh, here, uh, Lydia, can you please read these examples? In a few years, people are going to fly to Mars. In a few years, people will fly to Mars. Look at that. A spaceship is going to land. Not it will land. Dr. Green is going to speak tomorrow. Dr. Green will speak tomorrow. Dr. Green is speaking tomorrow. Dr. Green is giving a talk tomorrow. Oh, may I'll go. Great, I'll get you a ticket. I'm flying to Mars next week. I have already gotten a ticket. The shuttle to Mars leaves at 10 a.m. tomorrow. We land at midnight. Okay, we land at midnight. Okay, so we see, for example, here you can see the, the three different forms when we are using going to, will, and the present to talk about future intentions or plans. Okay, it's green really speaking tomorrow, but look what makes the difference. I'm going to, I'm going to speak is the time expressions that we use at the end. This is very important. Okay, never forget tomorrow. Uh, for example, if I say tomorrow morning, uh, 
tonight. Okay, for example, I'm going to sleep a lot tonight. It's in the future, right? It's a, an intention or a plan that I have. I will sleep a lot tonight. Okay? Or I am sleeping a lot tonight. I'm very tired. Okay, so then these are, you know, intentions or plans that I have. And then these are the, the, the expression that I can use tomorrow, the day after tomorrow, next week, next month, next year, uh, I don't know, uh, in two hours. Okay. Any time expression that is related to the future. Okay, so you can use it there. Now, look at those sentences there and probably you can uh, give me some examples using sentences about you, okay? It doesn't matter if it is the present, past, and see the intention that you have. Okay, volunteers? Me, teacher. Go ahead. For example, uh, in a few months, I probably will fly to Europe. I probably will fly to? Europe. To Europe, okay, in a few months. I will probably, there is a possibility, okay? Okay, but there is an intention, right? That for has, or plan maybe, right? And that has to do with traveling to Europe. Okay, anybody else? Me, me Okay, Laura, go ahead. I am going to do exercise on Friday. I am going to do exercise on Friday. Okay, so that's your plan. Okay. What else? Maybe I will. Maybe I will to. Maybe I will eat pizza tomorrow. Maybe, okay, yes, maybe I will eat. So this is, you know, a decision that you are doing in this moment. And then exists a possibility, right? Maybe I will eat pizza tomorrow. Suppose I that know. I... Uh -huh. I, I, don't, I don't know if this is correct, but uh, I have a, 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 a duda. A doubt. Doubt. Uh -huh. with, this, uh, with this because... Uh, will is something when you you have the intention to do something, but uh, going to is when you uh, you are sure that something we are going to pass. I don't know if that is correct. Going to is a prediction, okay, or or a plan that you have. Everything depends, uh, that's why it's very, this is very personal and that's why, you know, there are different ways to say it. Suppose if I tell you, uh, uh, I, I want to go, I want to go to the beach on Saturday morning, but I can't because I work on Saturday. Okay. I, and then they say, for example, I can't this Saturday because I work this Saturday. So then I work on Saturday morning. So this is some, something, you know, like I, if I usually do, so it's an activity. So for mm -hmm. example, I, I go, I, I exercise on Fridays. I exercise on Fridays. Or I play soccer on Fridays. Okay, this is for example, something that I do an activity. Okay, uh, I play, uh, I, if you say, I will play soccer on Saturday, or I will play soccer on Friday, then it's something that you uh, have the intention to do, okay? For example, what days do you have a schedule on the month to go to the supermarket? Well, for example, Monday. Okay, then you say, I go to the supermarket on Monday. Okay, okay. so then that means that is something that you have already scheduled. Okay, mm -hmm. then, uh, and then and then you can also say, you know, uh, I go, I go. Let's say I go to the supermarket every every Monday. 
okay, I will go to the supermarket next Monday. Today mm -hmm. I went, and then I will go until next Monday. So it, it depends on how you are expressing the idea. Okay? okay, thank you. Other examples, people. So practice. The idea is to use them and see if Is they there? are right or not. Yes. So, I have an exam, but I'm not sure. Oh, Mariana. Oh, well, maybe I will start to work the next Monday. Maybe I will start it's to work so... next Monday. Okay, exactly. Yes. So you are, mm -hmm. it's an intention that probably your boss or your company has, but exactly. it's a still a possibility, right? Maybe. Yes, exactly. Uh, you're not sure yet. Okay. Yes. But you see, this is, the, this is the message that you try to send to the person who is listening to you. Yes, okay. exactly. And then this is, that is exactly what you want to say. Okay, good. Okay, the idea is... For example, is, the, last, the last class, I say I'm going to... No, I, I don't remember, but I ha, today I have a problem to start to work. Mm -hmm. And I, I read, I read, sorry, I talk about this, this question, this question, this... Uh, this possibility. Um, this possibility because today I start to work, but I didn't... Uh, start oh. to work mm -hmm. because I had a problem. Okay. Yes. And then you want to start this week? Yes, exactly. Okay, so you will probably start next week. Yes, exactly. Okay. I don't have... You are not sure yet about okay. the, op the opening date. Okay, good. Yes. All right. Okay, anybody else? I'm going to come back to the office on September. I'm going to come back to the office in September. In September. <laughs> in September. Okay, so then your case is going to, okay, so you have a, about a future intention or plan, okay? Why in September, Nineveh? Where do you work? Because I work in the Cameroon. So ah, the hotel okay. is planning Turism. to open on August, um, but I work in the office Escalon. Okay. And the plan is um, come back, how do you say, poco a poco, los empleados. <laughs> little by little, step by step, little by step little. By step. Uh -huh. Little all, by little. All the employees, step by step, or little by little. Okay, good. Yeah. So then mm -hmm. that is one of the, mm -hmm. right? so the, like you say, the plan is, you say, for example, the plan is so yes, plan to, go, is. to go back little by little, okay, to the, mm -hmm. to the office, okay? Okay, that's mm -hmm. good. So then he said, I'm going to, that's the plan, yeah. plan. Okay, anybody else? Maybe I will watch TV tonight. Maybe I will watch TV tonight. Okay, this is a decision that you are making at the moment and that it will probably happen or maybe not. Maybe it's a 50-50, right? It depends on your mood. Okay, good. Yes, Ada? I visit my parents next, next week. Okay, I'll visit my parents next week. So you are here also in the letter D, right? Or yes. the letter... No, the letter C. Okay, ah. you have intentions or mm -hmm. plans. Okay, you can say, I will visit my parents next week. Okay, good. What else? Remember, uh, Ada, that in that case, you can, you can say it in three different ways. I am going to okay. visit my parents next week. I will visit my parents next week. Or I am visiting my parents next week. Okay. okay teacher. All right. So then there is no problem. Okay. I'm going, I'm going to I'm going to start to train in October. Mm -hmm. October. In October. In October. I'm going to start training in October. That's a plan. Yeah. Okay. That's a plan. Good. Tra training what? Teacher, uh, I have a question. Trail running. Oh, running. Okay. Good. Excellent. Who has a question, Laura? Yes, me. Okay, go ahead. Uh, uh, can I yes. use no, 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 no. present continuous in negative sentence? Go ahead. 
Joseph. When, when I speak future? Mm -hmm. Yes. Can I use negative? Yes, For you example, can. I am not flying to Mars next week. I am not flying? I am not flying to Mars next week. Oh, yes, to Mars. Uh -huh. Yes, no, I heard. Sorry, I heard. That's right. Yes, it is correct. I am not flying, uh, to, Mar I am not flying to Mars next week. Okay. Okay. For example, suppose, uh, suppose that, that, uh, that somebody give you the wrong information and they tell you, we are finishing this course tomorrow. Okay. And, okay. Then, you and then you tell me, teacher, uh, is it true that we are finishing this course tomorrow? And then I said, mm, no, Laura, you have the wrong information. We're not finishing this course tomorrow. We're not. We're not finishing. I'm using the negative. Okay, this course tomorrow. We're finishing on Thursday. <laughs> okay. So you see, you can you can use it in negative, no problem. Okay. Anybody else? Teacher. Yes, Mariela. In that case, we can use the one conditional. Only use a will. Because uh -huh. I'm going to no, I can use that. Which one? In that uh, case, no. We we combine this one with a conditional. Yes, you can. Yes. For example. For example. Uh, uh -huh. Go ahead. Yes, if I have, a, I don't know, if I have an opportunity to start right now, I will, I will start I will to take work. It. <laughs> Uh -huh. yes. I don't know, but it's only example. <laughs> yes, yes. And yes. Now, for example, if I have an opportunity, if I have present, if, if I, I have, have an opportunity to start working now, yes, I will. Take I will. It. Mm -hmm. ah, it's okay. For example, if I have a better job opportunity now, I will take it. I will take it. Uh -huh. ah, yes, you okay. can use. Okay, then you can use in the, uh, for example, um, uh, the future for. Let me see. Uh, this is they call it the first condition. I guess I'm not. I don't remember in this moment. But uh, yes. uh, uh -huh. and then there is another one. For example, uh, if I am flying to New York, okay, I I buy a first class ticket. Yes, exactly. Okay, uh -huh. if I'm flying, uh -huh. so you guess you can use them in some of the, yeah. in some of these expressions. Okay. okay, all right. Thanks. Good. Okay, anybody else? Yeah. Okay. I don't know. Yes. Who? Okay. Can you hear me? Who's speaking? I hear I hear somebody, but I don't see oh yes. Yeah. Okay. Go. We are going to keep the class tomorrow night. Tomorrow at night. I'm going to? Give. Going to give the class tomorrow tomorrow. tomorrow night. Yes. Are you going? Oh, you are going. You are going to give a class tomorrow night. Yes, I am. Okay, I am going to teach tomorrow. Yes, are you? Can you hear? Yes. Okay, good. Okay, anybody else? Nobody? Okay, one with present. Give me an example with present. Me, teacher. Okay, Elena. I am going to wake up at 8 a.m. tomorrow. I'm going to wake up. To wake up, okay. I'm going to wake up at 8 a.m. tomorrow. Hey, that's nice. I can't. <laughs> okay. Is it true? Yes. Okay. <laughs> Perfect. Okay. I'm going to wake up at eight o'clock tomorrow. Good. Nice. Nice. Okay. Anybody else? Any teacher. Okay, Olivia. Uh, it's that correct? Uh, my mom is cooking tomorrow. My mom is cooking tomorrow. That's a great one. Very good. Okay. So then they say, for example, okay, uh, tomorrow I am free. My mom is cooking tomorrow. 
probably you have been cooking all these days, right? Right. Mm -hmm. Your happiness and my mom is cooking tomorrow. You know, and that is a, when you say that, is that you feel that she for sure is cooking tomorrow. It's more than a plan, right? Yes. Okay, good. What else? Teacher. Yes. Is in present is correct when uh, I say I drive to San Miguel uh, tomorrow morning. I uh -huh. I drive to San Miguel. Okay. Tomorrow morning. Okay. For example, yeah, because it's a a. What is a, it's a schedule that you have, right? It's an event that you have already scheduled, right? Okay. You can say, uh, I drive to San Miguel, okay? I take my car to San Miguel tomorrow morning. Something like, you know, that's a plan that we have. Okay. Okay. Good. Anybody else? Now, is it clear now what we have about the future? Carlos, you haven't said anything. Uh, uh, maybe practice to to exam tomorrow. I tell me the complete pra sentence. I will. Maybe, I'm going to. Uh, I will. I'm going to practice uh, the exam unit three tomorrow. Okay, you're going to practice with the exam unit three, with the exam unit three tomorrow. Okay, yeah. that's your plan. Okay, good. That's a good practice. Okay, anybody else? We have... Okay, yes, Lord. Okay, for example, always remember that when we are using the, that when we are using this, uh, when we are using the, especially the ING form or the present, it is important that we use a time expression. And what are the time expressions? The time expressions are tomorrow, the day after tomorrow, uh, if it is in the morning, you say this afternoon, you say tonight. Okay, if this moment I cannot say this afternoon because it's already night, but I, but to talk about the future today, I say tonight or later, uh, or later, I can say later, I will, uh, I will take my dinner, right? Or well, I'm taking my dinner after this class. So this is uh, something like plan, right? Uh, I take, uh, I take my dinner after class. Okay, it's, it's something that, that I said, you know, uh, in this moment that is going to happen when I finish this action. Okay, so then always, always we need a time expression. What else? Uh, also, when we're using, I am, I am going, for example, I'm not going to, I'm not going to play soccer this week. I'm not playing, I'm not playing soccer on Friday. I'm not playing soccer on Saturday. I'm not watching TV tomorrow because I have a lot of work to do. Uh, I am, uh, let's say, uh, I'm not, uh, I am not listening to my favorite music uh, tonight because I am tired and I want to sleep. Okay, so you, you say tonight, there is always expression of time. Okay. okay, good. Now just let's see what we have in the on the platform. Yes, we watch this one, right? Yeah. 
not again. Let's see if we can. Can you can you read this in your computers? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Okay, good. Yeah, because I think uh, from this one is going to be a little bit difficult, but we can listen to it. Okay, listen first, you know, to the, we're gonna listen three times. The first one is just for you to, to get acquainted with the pronunciation. The second time, pay attention to vocabulary. And the third time, just to listen to the intonation. Listen and practice. I'm so excited. We have two weeks off. What are you going to do? I'm not sure. I guess I'll just stay home. Maybe I'll watch a few DVDs. What about you? Any plans? Yeah. I'm going to relax at the beach with my cousin for a couple of weeks. We're going to go surfing every day. Sounds like fun. Say, why don't you come with us? Do you mean it? I'd love to. I'll bring my surfboard. Okay, now check the new expressions or vocabulary. Listen and practice. I'm so excited. We have two weeks off. What are you going to do? I'm not sure. I guess I'll just stay home. Maybe I'll watch a few DVDs. What about you? Any plans? Yeah. I'm going to relax at the beach with my cousin for a couple of weeks. We're going to go surfing every day. Sounds like fun. Say, why don't you come with us? Do you mean it? I'd love to. I'll bring my surfboard. Okay, good. And the last time? <laughs> for the intonation because after you're going to practice the comment. Okay, good. Okay, so we have this one just a P because I cannot read it. Okay, good. Now, Ada and Lily. Can you please read the conversation, please? Uh, who's the first person? What's the name? Well, the conversation disappears, teacher. Uh, you cannot read it. You cannot see it. Ah, okay. Wait. Yeah, because I thought you could see it. Then let me... I saw Ada's face, what conversation. <laughs> <laughs> Me too, because I was you know, like, what? <laughs> I don't worry. But this is very small in my computer. Can you read okay. that? Can you read it? Yes. Yes, teacher. Really? My goodness. No, po no, no teacher. teacher. Huh? I, no, I can't read. But wait a minute, just let me... I'm so tired. I know, just wait a minute, just let me... I just want to... I guess you can open in a new link. No, mm -hmm. I, mean, it, I mean, here it says that there is no preview, so that I cannot um. a preview available. He says, file is in owner's bin. So probably the person who uploaded the image has it, has it in her private 
thing. So that's why you cannot see it. But I, I think the problem is that I have this. I need to disappear this. This. When you when you click in class, I I can read teacher. Class. Yes, class. What class? Uh, mass. She said the, the sign, the plus, the signal mass. Oh yes, yes. the sign. Yes. Yeah. No, yes. the thing is that I want to, but I I don't know how to make this disappear for us. But before I can read, but read. now no. Yes, yes. Yes, yes. Now, now yes. Now. Yes. My goodness. <laughs> Finally. Okay, good. Okay, Ada and Emily, right? Okay. Go ahead. Okay. Um, I'm so sorry. We have two weeks off. What are you going to do? I'm not sure. I guess I just stay home. Maybe I watch a few DVDs. What about you? Any plans? Yeah, I'm going <coughs> to relax at the beach with my cousin for a couple of weeks. We are going to go surfing every day. Sounds like, sounds like fun. Say, why don't I can see because the... <laughs> Why do you come? Don't you? With us. Why don't you come with us? <laughs> come with us. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> okay. Do you mean it? I love to. I love to. I bring my surfboard. I'll bring my surfboard. I bring my surfboard. Surfboard. Okay. Good. Surfboard. Mm -hmm. Okay, now uh, two more volunteers, but I, I want you to, I mean, just, you know, this is the first time, right? So then uh, after that, if you want to try again, you can do it. Okay, but try to, you know, there is something in English that they say, listen and imitate. Okay, so then uh, what we have to do is, now pay attention to this again. With the same impetus. Yes, with the same feeling. Because this is this is what it takes is just the practice. Listen and practice. I'm so excited. We have two weeks off. What are you going to do? Okay, you hear that? She said, I'm so excited. We have two weeks off, right? We have two weeks off. Okay, what are we going to do? I'm not sure. I guess I'll just stay home. Maybe I'll. And they say, mm, I'm not sure. You know, like, no sé. Okay, something like, uh, maybe I'll just stay home. Okay, uh, maybe I'll just stay home. Watch a few DVDs. Watch a few DVDs. Okay, drink a couple of sodas, make some pupusas, and then stuff like that. You know, okay. just like you now relax things that you, you're supposed to do, what right? We can invent to. Uh huh, yes. You know, what about you? Yeah, I'm going to relax at the beach with my cousin for a couple of weeks. Okay, I'm going to relax at the beach with my cousin for a couple of weeks. Okay. I'm going to stay in my house and sleep for long hours, um, watch TV, eat a lot, get fat, and then don't do exercise and, and enjoy life. This is JOLO. You only live once. Right? We're going to go surfing every day. We're going to go surfing every day. Sounds like fun. Say, hey, why don't you come with us? Do you mean it? I'd love to. I'll bring Hey, say, hey, why don't you come with us? This say something like, hey, why don't you come with us? Okay. Surfboard. So this is, you know, the, what makes sometimes your English sounds more, uh, let's say, uh, more vivid, right? 
and that you can probably feel more comfortable when you speak the language, all right? So don't feel, uh, let's say, uh, uh, don't, feel, don't be shy, okay? Just do it. It doesn't matter, it can be two boys. Now we're gonna use two boys. Uh, we're gonna use her, and I don't know, Javier, are you there? Yes? Javier? No. No. No, but Javier was there. Oh, yes, here he is. Yes, Javier? Yes. Okay, then Javier, you begin, and then for you read the, the second part, the second part of the conversation, right? Okay. Okay, go Javier. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. We have to go. What are you going to do? I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Uh, no, 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 this is my, this is my part. That's, that's, that's for, for her, huh? Javier is like the people in the karaoke, they, they, <laughs> <laughs> they, they don't, no lo dejan cantar a uno. Uh -huh. They don't let you sing, go ahead. I'm yeah. not sure. I'm not sure. I guess I just stay home. Maybe I will watch a few DVDs. A few DVDs. What about you? Any plans? Yeah, I'm going to relax at the beach with my cousin for a couple of weeks. We're going to surf. We are. We're going to go surfing every day. Sounds like fun. Hey, why don't you come with us? Do you, um, do you mean it? I'd love to, I'll bring my surfboard. I'll bring my surfboard. Okay, very good. Okay, now we're getting better, we're getting better. Okay, other, other two volunteers. Now two more girls. Yes. Okay, we have? Uh, Mariela. Okay, Mariela and Anna. Okay. Hey, okay. Who? Aide. Okay, then uh, in the next one, Aide, you do it. Okay, now go Mariela and Anna. Okay. Okay. Don't be shy, okay? Don't be shy. Just act it out. Okay. Like if you were <laughs> acting in Hollywood, okay? Go ahead. It's okay. <laughs> Anna first? I'm so I'm excited. We have to wait so. What are you going to do? I'm not sure. I guess. I just stay home. Maybe I I watch a few DVDs. Uh, what What about you? Any plans? Yeah, I'm going to relax at the beach with my cousin for a couple of weeks. We are going to go surfing every day. Sounds like fun. Say uh, say we don't you come with us. Do you mean it? I love that. I'll bring my server. I'll bring my server. Okay, very I'll good. <laughs> very, very good. Okay. But you see, for example, what, what do you think that uh, is necessary? What is the sensation that you have? Hmm? It's just practice, right? Yes, exactly. The more you listen, the more you practice it, then your, 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 your points of articulation are getting more flexible and easy for you to pronounce, okay? And to speak. Yes. Okay, good. Now I did, okay, and Laura. Okay, yes. Ready, Laura? Yes. Okay, go ahead. Then I did, you are Julia, and Laura, you're Nancy. Okay, wait. I'm so excited. We have to wiggle. What are you going to do? I'm not sure. I guess I'll use a stay home. Maybe I will watch a few DVDs. What about you? Any plans? Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to relax at the beach with my cousin for a couple of weeks. 
we're going to go surfing every day. Sound like fun. Say. Why don't you? Yes. Laura? Um, say, why don't you come with? I don't know. No, that's come what with I get us. Come with us. Oh, I'm sorry. Do you meet it? I love, I love to alt bring my surfboard. I bring my surfboard. Okay, good. Okay, this is, you know, one, one uh, let's say one strategy or technique that we can use to, you know, to sound out, to pronounce, to practice pronunciation, right? So then uh, let's see one more, Ricardo and Diego. Yes. Okay, read it. Okay. okay. I am okay. Julia, what? You, you begin, yes, you begin and then Ricardo continues. Okay. I'm so, I'm so excited. We have two weeks off. What are you going to do? I'm not sure. I guess I'll just stay home. Maybe I'll watch a few DVDs. What about you? Any plan? Yeah, I'm going to relax at the beach with my cousin for a couple of weeks. We are going to go surfing every day, every day. Sounds like fun. Say, say, why don't you come with me, with us? Do you mean it? I love it too. I'll bring my surfboard. I'll bring my surfboard. Okay, very good, excellent. Okay, guys, this is what you are going to do. Uh, uh, let's say that tomorrow we're going, to, well, uh, first of all, I will bring some, some other activities and Okay, we're going to practice a conversation similar to this, but you are going to create it, okay? So then uh, we're gonna work in pairs tomorrow to create your own conversations using the future, okay? For example, a, let's say a, like, uh, who said, Maria, like, yes, you told me that you that you will probably, or maybe you will, you are going to start working next week, right? Next Monday. Yes. Okay, then a, then probably somebody else can say, okay, oh, that's, that sounds nice, but nowadays it's a little dangerous, right? Okay, uh, be careful. And then you can begin, you know, using a conversation talking about different issues or just invent something, right? Uh, next uh, month, I'm, I'm going to fly to, to uh, let's say, to Cuba, right? Cuba to or I have two weeks uh, off and I, ha I need to have a nice vacation, okay? And I am planning to travel to uh, the, uh, Car the Caribbean, the Caribbean, the Caribbean uh, islands, okay? Baradero, right? Yeah. So that would be one. And then I want to know that place. I have I've heard that it's a good place. So invent, you know, to create. Uh, also, uh, we need to review a little bit about the use of adjectives, okay? And then uh, uh, we're going to to use, for example, those expressions, right? Now, questions in this moment? No. No doubt. No. Okay. Then I will I will uh, share with you the presentation in the chat later, okay? the future, the one that I show you today, okay, the PowerPoint, I will put it in the WhatsApp chat, okay, and the, so that you can study the example and prepare for tomorrow, okay? Okay, teacher. Okay, okay. so then, uh, then review it, and if you have questions about other, uh, other uh, topics that we studied before, let me know, okay? So that we can review something tomorrow. Okay, Thank so have a very good night. Thank okay. you. Stay safe. Okay. Uh, bye bye. Bye bye. See you. Bye bye. 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 Bye b